What's going on guys? My name is Zotzi Nombis and today I've built the biggest addition to our LEGO Minecraft World series yet. This is a massive LEGO Minecraft castle. Stands at over 2 feet tall and uh, 3 feet wide. It was built with an estimated 20,000 LEGO bricks. I used uh, torches and trees and tons of light gray pieces, even some pickaxes. And for the center jewel uh, we have cake and some statues with uh, some fish. Uh, also, it comes with tons of Lego accessories and mobs, which I'll go over in a second, but Steve has some alternate skins, too. We have King Steve, complete with a diamond cape. We have Steve the Peasant, and, uh, of course, Steve in his full-on diamond armor. The ultimate defense for Steve, and uh, you can see Lego has official creepers now, so that's awesome. You can see him taking out a couple of them there. It's a long way down to the bottom. Uh, inside, it's fully furnished, so we have a Lego enchanting room and uh, lots of food as well. And it's so big that you can make a house for a small pet, as you can see there. I use lots of little uh, light gray profile bricks to give it that uh, detail. Inside, I use tons of smooth tiles, and uh, the towers come off, and Steve has a nice bedroom. If you guys want to build this LEGO Minecraft bed, it was built on a 6x4 brown base plate. I used uh, red smooth tiles for the blankets, and then white for the creeper banner, I use green tiles, and uh, that's definitely the secret for that polished Minecraft look. Lots of tiles. You can see I used uh, dark gray, light gray, and then black and white for the checkerboard inside. I also used uh, yellow and green stem flower pieces to give it some decoration. And for the battlements, I used some 2x2 uh, two two Lego bricks. Also, King Steve has his trusty steed, the pig, and a zombie janitor. I'm sure if you've played Minecraft at some point, you've uh, attempted to or have built a castle. And from LEGO, it's not too different. You just have to start with a base plate. And then, of course, uh, sort out all your gray or and uh, dark gray. Those are definitely the main colors. If you want to make a stone castle, if you want to make it out of snow or gold, then sort out your white or uh, yellow. Uh, the bricks as well, to get the little details, I use lots of pillar pieces. That helps to save bricks. And if you have uh, little bricks with designs on them, like bricks or lines in them, that can give it some extra detail as well. But uh, you can just pretty much go crazy with it. You can see also the ender dragon is big enough to fit in there, so that can be Steve's pet and defend it from any other greedy dragons that want to uh, take it over. I also use some pickaxes on the walls and even some little statues as well. There's also a light brick in uh, the fireplace just to give it that sort of lava uh, glow like you can do in Minecraft. The trees were polished out with green smooth tiles and I used a ton of dark gray bricks on the base just to give it that sort of cobblestone look. But there you have it. I hope you guys enjoyed this Lego Minecraft castle. Let me know in the comments your idea for the next Lego creation. Make sure to give the video a thumbs up if you guys want to see some more stuff uh, on this sort of scale. And thank you guys so much for watching my videos. So I'll see you guys in another video with another Lego creation. A great place as well to store some Lego golden coins, as you can see right there.